Hi, I'm Bonnie Browning with the American Quilter Society, and one of my favorite things to do here at the AQS Quilt Week in Paducah is to interview the winners in our contest. This morning, I'm here with Laura Welklins from Noblesville, Indiana, and congratulations on winning first place in the miniatures. Thank you. Now, this is working in tiny detail, yes, isn't it? Is. it? Well, one of the first things I wanted to ask you about is the background fabric of your quilt because it's beautiful and it looks like it might be silk, but you tell me it isn't. It is not silk, it's cotton. It is oak shot cotton and it's a shot cotton, so it's woven with two different colors of fabrics. One color is a very bright yellow and the other color is a very bright blue and so it makes this beautiful green and it's almost an iridescent looking green. So it looks like you put it in a dye pot then and it came out green, yeah, right? Yeah, you look at it from different directions and it looks like it's a different color. Okay, well it's beautiful background fabric. Thank you. All right, now this is an applique technique yes. that you've used, so tell us what you've done. The, the bright blue here the, in the background of the big flower, I have used turned edge applique and I do that by machine and it's an invisible stitch by machine with invisible thread. Okay. The rest of the the flowers and things are all fused raw edge applique and I've stitched those in silk with a blanket stitch around all the edges. Okay now you've used a teeny tiny yes. narrow stitch so uh, what size is that stitch to make it look so beautiful? The length is a one and the width is a one so yes it's, it's about as tiny as you can get. And, and you made circles that look like they might be an eighth of an inch they across? Are. Yes. Really? Yes. And so is it fun manipulating around that tight little circle? <laughs> They're difficult to cut out, yes. You need some very <laughs> sharp scissors. And I think one of the things that really helps are reverse grip tweezers. So you can use those to hold on to the fabric as you are cutting. Okay. And that really helps a lot. And also you need to cut about a few more than what you actually <laughs> need because you will lose them before you get them on your quilt. Uh, and, and so those were fused down too, which yes. helps to hold them in place for you yes. as you stitch. Exactly. Okay, and now uh, how did you machine quilt it? Um, the machine, it's with silk thread, and I use the kimono silk from Superior, and um, just did a lot of practice before I actually quilted it. Okay, and now I know a lot of the quilters are using silk thread for their mm -hmm. quilting. What do you see as the benefit of using silk versus a cotton or a blended uh, thread? I like the silk because it's, um, it's a hundred weight silk and so it blends into the background. You see the kind of the loft that you make when you quilt. You don't necessarily see the stitches, which is always a plus but it just gives it a beautiful look. So you, you see the dimension that the quilting Exactly, and this creates. one has a wool bat in it too, which helps give it a little bit more dimension than a, than a cotton batting does. Yes, and for those of out there who haven't tried wool bat, they need to know that the wool springs back. Yes. So it, it, it goes down where you stitch, and then you get a nice uh, uh, a loft yes. before the next stitching, don't you? Yes, you do. Yes. Yes, it almost looks like a trapunto without the work of a trapunto. Don't have to cut anything yeah, out. Yeah, that's you? a great benefit. <laughs> All right, and so um, you, I know you entered your quilt online, mm -hmm. and so how was that process for you? Oh, very easy. Okay. You just have to fill out the information, upload a couple of photos, and send it on. And there you go. Oh, it's extremely easy. And you know the benefit for AQS is we don't have to retype all that stuff either. Okay. You've already <laughs> typed it in. <laughs> so we hope that you'll have an entry in the next AQS contest because you can't win if you don't enter, can you? That's right.